Yo guys, welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to yet another video. And in today's video, we are going to turn this into this. Yeah. Now, first of all, I am really sorry that I did not upload a video last week. As you guys know, I was pretty busy with other house. I also just came back from a four day trip doing the scooter rally. We got the Super Adventure R, we got little Honda. And look at that, I am organizing every single bolt, nut, you name it. Because, as you guys know, I'm going to be doing a lot more motorcycle car related stuff. With the Jimny, with the Brabus, with the KTMs. Let's get cracking on that one. It's an absolute mess. I have no idea what brand it is, but it does say powered by Briggs and Stratton. No idea what Briggs and Stratton is, never heard of it. Anyway, let's paint it orange. This is looking like something straight out of a Mad Max movie or something. What a beast. Yeah, it ain't. That's a lot of work. <laughs> now look at that. We got some kind of graveyard going on over here. It's time for some, uh, let's foam it up. It's time for some cleaning.
Now, for some reason, my gut feeling is telling me that my lawnmower is not gonna be running by the end of this video. And I'm gonna have to be pushing it onto the lawn. Anyway, let's continue. <laughs> Now, I just noticed that negative camber on that lawnmower. Like, what the hell? Tuning scene. <laughs> Look at that. Decent. Now, you guys know me and you know that I really like KTMs, but I'm not really a big fan of orange. So I do like a little bit of orange details, but too much orange, not gonna cut it for me. So, so the big flaps on the side are going to be white. We got some nice little decals. Oh yeah, I got some stickers too. This is going to be the most badass lawnmower you guys have ever seen. Look at this, 2009, three bottles of raw 2009 orange, KTM orange. Yeah, buddy. Now I know that cellulose thinner is really good to remove old paint and acetone is really good to remove dirt, grease, any synthetic product, dried paint and nail polish. So I was like, if I combine these two, I'm gonna have the perfect thing to degrease the lawnmower. This mixture is going to be the best mixture ever. And it's going to do the job perfectly fine. I'm getting a little bit nauseous here. Not much that can go wrong, just add a little bit of cellulose thinner. I'm just gonna use this the thinner alone. Now that we got everything primered and sanded, it is time for some RAL 9003 Signal Wise Gloss. In case you don't know, Signal Wise Gloss is actually Husqvarna White. And as this is a really unknown brand, very old geezer, I'm not gonna pull it all the way apart, sand blasters and put it back together. Anyway, let's paint the frame. Frame needs to be orange. KTM orange. That wink is kinda awkward. This is like a spray paint bottle from an online shop. I even had to change the nozzle. This is just like water. It's garbage. It's really garbage paint. Now the job is almost done. We have the frame painted. We have the parts painted in signal wise, signal wise white. Yeah, we got the wheels, wheels, rims painted in black, just at the Super Adventure 1290R. And yeah, now I gotta wait until the paint is dry. Now I'm gonna put it together, add some stickers, show you guys the end product.
Now, how do you guys like that? Yeah, I know that little jump I tried with lawnmower on my pit bike track didn't work out that well. Now, looking really good. If you ask me, it's a lot better as that gray. Let me know in the comments what do you guys think. Do I have to paint it gray again? Or leave KTM orange. Sadly enough, that is it for today's video. Yet again, I am heavily sunburned. I'm gonna hop in my pool. Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace, drive safe, especially with lawnmowers. They're very dangerous.